What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Need for Speed Payback. Today we need a new drift build, so uh, we're gonna see what we can do. Now we have a ton of new cars to choose from. In our last episode, if you guys remember, we were missing some of the ones that we should have had. Now those are back, so uh, we've got a lot to choose from. We've got the DB11 here to level 254 for 215,000. We've got the McLaren 570S Coupe, this thing looks nasty. I love, love, love some of the new McLarens. So uh, this thing is absolutely nuts. Look at that NOS capacity. 10 out of 10. It's level 294 for 180K. We've got the Audi R8 V10 Plus, 288 for 170K. We've got the Porsche 911 GT3 RS. These things are nasty. It's level 258. Got the old school Porsche, we already did that for drifting. We've got the NSX, we've got the GTR Premium, we've got the Viper SRT, we've got the F-Type R Coupe, we've got the AMG GT. Dude, we've got so much to choose from here. So I think our next actual like main race car, race spec is gonna be the GTR. I really wanna get a GTR and completely maximize it out, make it look the best possible, and that's gonna be like our, our rush vehicle. I want that to be what we end off the series with. So we're gonna save that for later. So really, I mean, we could choose between the 911, the Audi R8, the 570S. I, w I would say between those three. Those are those are my go-tos here. So we're gonna take a look at zero to 60 in top speed. So 2.93 and 193, 3.1 and 205, and 3.1 and 204. Part of me just, dude, I, I kinda wanna do the Audi R8. We could do the R8 as an enforcer, though. I feel like the R8 would be a pretty dope enforcer. What do you guys think? Do we have anything else that's significantly faster in 0 to 60? Why is the GTR 3.3? It should be faster than that. Um, it honestly, it, it looks like... It looks like the McLaren might be our best bet for zero to 60 in 2.9 seconds. Let's go for it, dude. Here we go. I like it. Use this for a new car, yes please. So brand new drag build coming right up. Here we go, boys. First things first, I do think that we should, um, let's take a look at locations on the map. Is there any sort of parts upgrade? Yeah, we're gonna go to a parts upgrade thing over here. We're gonna upgrade some of the parts on there, make it just a little bit better. It's a pretty high level already, but it's definitely got a little bit of work we could do on it. And uh, then we're gonna go customize it in the garage. So actually, hold on, let me, let me see what we're looking at here. 310 is the recommended level. So honestly, we're not in a bad spot right here, but we could use a little bit. We'll, we'll just do one, one tune up on each thing. So this is what I said before, every time I get a new car, I don't sit here for too long, but I'll just, I'll get a new gearbox, a new exhaust, a new yada, yada, yada. So we got acceleration gearbox, level 13 with nitrous acceleration and speed, dude, that is fantastic. So we got a gearbox, then we're gonna move on to exhaust. See what we're rocking with here. Level 13 with nitrous. All right. Onto our ECU. Dude, we're already jumping up in level, boy. This feels good. Acceleration. Level 13 ECU, I'll take it. Go ahead and equip that. Turbo. What are we gonna get for a turbo here? Another acceleration, dude. This is gonna be the ultimate drag build. Are you kidding me? This is insane. Almost everything we have so far is based off of acceleration. We need to get a, a three-part brand. Brakes. Level 14 engine block, though. That's still pretty good. We don't really need brakes and drags. But, I mean, level 14 is solid. And finally, head is going to be our last one. We're going to get speed, level 13. Not huge, but we'll take it. So, we've got two outlaws, or two, two of the cacti. We want another cacti. Let's get another cacti get, to get that three-part bonus. It is called outlaw, I thought it was. If you match three of the same brands, you get a bonus. So now we want something that we didn't already have. Level 17 exhaust. It's gonna take down our nitrous power a little bit. 
But then it's going to give us the bonus with the outlaw match. Dude, that is insane. All right. We... That is the best that we've had. Easily. That is the best that we've had in terms of luck of drawing cards right off the bat. So I'm feeling good about this, boys. This 570S is about to be lit. This is going to be good. All right. We're going to head in the garage here. I love this game, man. I seriously, I'm having so much fun with this game. Shout out to all you guys watching this series consistently. I love you, man. All right, here we go. So, I'm going to go in. I'm going to be lazy again. We're going to check out what the community has for wraps. Some of these are pretty nasty already. So, this is just all black, but it's going to have the gold rims. This looks pretty good. We've got the red and black, blue and red. Here's kind of like a golden black. That doesn't look bad, but that's not that special. We've got a Cars version. That's actually kind of dope, I'm not gonna lie. We've got red and black, but that's kind of like what we just did for our Diablo. I don't want to get too similar. Dude, a lot of these are Cars versions. I kind of like that, but it's a little bit cheesy, dude. I want to I want to try to keep it a, at least a little bit real, you know what I mean? We've got the white and black with like the mustache on the front. I actually really like this. This is clean. That one is super clean. Just kind of quickly glancing through here. I either want to go for this one or I want to go for the one we saw at the front. This one. I'm going to go for this one. I think that looks really clean. All right, successfully downloaded and applied to the car. Looks good to me. I'm just going to keep those same colors. I think that looks fantastic. So for um, for underglow, orange, I guess. All right. Tire smoke, orange. Orange doesn't look bad. We'll go with orange nitrous as well. Orange nitrous. Next up, do we want to change up the hood a little bit? That doesn't look bad. I'll take that. Bumper we can't change yet. Splitter. Too much. All of that is just too much. Dude, it's already a good looking car on its own. You don't, you don't need all that business. I kind of like these with the vents in them, dude. Those are pretty dope. I'll take that. Mirrors. Something like that is kind of cool. I'm going to go with that, dude. That looks super nice and futuristic and kind of fits with the, the curves of the car. Side skirts, obviously going to want some carbon in here. It kind of... No, we're, I'm not going to change them. It messes with our wrap. We're definitely going to have to change up our... Uh, ooh, I don't like that at all. Rear bumper. That's kind of dope. Takes away the license plate. I actually like that. That's pretty cool. Spoiler. I don't think I'm going to put a spoiler on there. Oh, dude. Some of these are so ugly. Are you kidding me? I mean, something big and gaudy like that isn't too bad, but something like that is just ugly. I think I'm going to leave it. Tail lights. Smoke them out a little bit. Why not? Everybody loves smoke tail lights. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I always completely back out of it on accident. All right. Um... Now we're going to have to do the wheels. Oh, exhausts. Let's check out the exhausts. I don't like the ones that come out too far. These are stock. Those don't look bad, but those are pretty much the same thing, right? Yeah, those are same thing, but darker. I kind of like the darker look, though. So I'm going to go for the dark exhaust. It all kind of fits together. Tires. These things are kind of big and ugly, dude. I'm going to change the... I think it's the rims that make them big and ugly. Where's that one with the gold trim that we saw? Like black with a gold lip or something? That would look good on here. I guess as a drag car, it's just going to have a big fat tire in there anyway. So that's why I don't like it. I don't know. I, I kind of want like a, a skinnier, nicer looking... It just doesn't look right to me. But it's not bad. All right, let's go ahead and change the rims here. I don't mind the uh, the rim we have on the backside back there. I think these are RTRs that I had. Let me see. 
I think they're here. Were these it? I want to have the same rims this time. Yeah, those are the same. We just got to change the colors. Rims. Primary paint we had is black. And then secondary paint we had is like the gold to match the outside. All right. That looks pretty nice. I like it, boys. I think it looks good. Got the orange underglow. Everything's looking solid. We change anything up on the roof, sound system. Not gonna do anything there. Looks like we're good, man. All right. Brand new drag car. She looks good. I like it. Very interesting lines and, and little decals and stuff. I like the way it turned out. Dude, the, the bottom middle of my foot, like the sole of my foot, really itches right now. Or not the sole, the, the like in between the arch and the sole. It's kind of the sole a little bit. I don't know what's going on. Look at that wide body Mustang right there, dude. There are gonna be so many cool builds we're gonna have to check out, for sure. This thing does a wheelie. Are you kidding me? What happens if we use nitrous? It stays wheeling. What in the world, dude? Hold on. This thing wheelies with no nitrous. Holy cow, this is gonna be absolutely nuts. All right. That is so crazy, dude. It makes it very hard to turn, obviously. You can't turn like that, but. China, I need you to settle an argument between Jeff and me. What's best for downtown racing? European sport compact or American muscle? American muscle. Of sheer power. American muscle. No contest. See, Jeff? That's what I said. Muscle cars attract too much attention. European compacts blend in better, but can still dish out the acceleration. Well, Mac, Jess is not wrong. What's the point of having a car that blends in? Like The turning on this thing is really not that great. I'm not going to lie to you guys, but the speed is absolutely nuts, dude. This thing feels nice. I wonder what kind of top speeds we're going to be reaching in this. Give me a straight. Asking you shall receive. Oops. Didn't last straight very long, did it? Dude, this thing is, the zero to 60 is ridiculous. This thing is so fast. We're up to 204. So our Diablo in the last episode was cruising like, this is the fastest we've ever been in this game, without a doubt. Oh, we missed the checkpoint. No, that makes me sad, dude. We were killing that one, too. This is the fastest we've ever been, though. Like, no doubt. We're up in the 220s, dude. Diamond block, baby. Y'all ain't ready for this. Y'all know what's coming. Oh, we totally overshot that. You can always tell what kind of day it's gonna be by the sunrise. <laughs> Today feels like it's gonna be a racing day. Dude, we are about to absolutely destroy these fools. We're 20 levels ahead. You struggle through life while we toy with it. Nothing is ever exciting enough, dangerous enough, worthy enough for us. We are Diamond Block. Never heard of us? Well, you must not be a millionaire then. Wheelie for three seconds and win the race? Finally, I can partake in these challenges. I think I could have before. You guys told me down in the comments all I had to do was use nitrous at the start. So do I just hold it now? We didn't get it. We didn't wheelie at all. Or not enough, I mean, we did for two seconds, but. Dang it. That makes me mad. I guess I still can't really participate. We probably need one of those super heavy lifted old school cars on like the drag blocks. 
Or we could probably just lift our car a little bit. Wonder if we lifted it, gave us a little bit more room. I, I don't know, dude. I'm not too worried about it. Let's do it again. Oh, we got it. Oh, it's over the course of two. Oh, it counts for two, uh, for the two rounds. Oh my God. Okay, dragging has gotten a lot more difficult. There's a lot more to watch out for. Our first drag quest was not nearly anything like this where you actually had a ton of turns and people cutting you off and stuff. So. First man, down. Gotta finish this. Oh, is this supposed to uh, win three rounds? Look at those perfect shifts, baby. I was ready for that guy to be coming for me that time. Not to mention we hit all our shifts, so we were way faster. Holy cow, dude. These guys can't even come close. Yes, yes, yes! Alright. And that's how it's done. New record, baby! That's what I like to see. We had a total time. Okay, so it's total time throughout the entire event. Nice, boys. So, I mean, we're just gonna be able to get that just straight up playing. We don't even have to, to actually think about that. Level 14 head. I'm gonna go ahead and how much do you get for this? 4,600. I'm just gonna trade it in. All right. First race of five down. Let's go ahead and move on to to Buster number two. Hey man, do you think you could at least try to find a place with less people in the way? They'll either get out of the way or they won't. There are easier ways to bet your life. Oh, Tyler Morgan. You will not last long. My name is Mikko Vasile. You're going to prove yourself before you race Diamond Block again. A time trial, then. Succeed or don't. I cannot. I'm fine with time trials. That doesn't scare me at all. Let's do it. Dude, this thing is so ridiculously fast. 155 miles an hour. This is child's play, man. What are you guys doing to me out here? Me in the road this time, but I still can't let up. The handling on this thing is like handling a, a freight truck. It's so bad. It's seriously, it is so painful. This thing is 100% made to go in a straight line, and that is it. There's there's no no drifting. Hitting the brakes does not send it sideways. You just gotta e-brake it and hit a hard, hard corner. This is like driving a, a refrigerator, is what this feels like. I imagine this is what driving a fridge would, would be. Oh, hey. Actually, if we hit the brakes and the the e-brake at the same time, it kind of gets a little sideways. Pro tip. It's it's necessary that you do that, otherwise it won't get sideways. Excuse you. We're okay. Let's get some air. You can kind of maneuver it a little bit. Oh, we got a billboard. Let's go, boys. Dirt isn't as big of a problem, that's for sure. Holy cow, dude. If we actually complete this, we're going to no problem. We just got to cut down on the crashes a little bit. This weekend with your McLaren 570S, ran it to a bunch of billboards and random stuff on the road and other cars. A little bit more speed. 
Dude, it just, it does not, it does not want to go sideways. It's those fatty tires that make it look so dumb. That garbage truck has better handling than this shiz. Oh. <laughs> I tried to cover around that corner and kind of cut across both lanes. It didn't work. Dude, this is painful. I'll stick to drag races in this thing, please. That wasn't bad. Uphill cornering. Nope, not really. The nitrous capacity is ridiculous, dude. Excuse you! Hey, look at that, boys! We can do it! Trying to make sure we're always getting to the next objective. Only thing on my mind. As well as massive ludicrous speed. Mobby. We got it. <laughs> Dude, this thing is so ridiculous. Alright. So he's happy with us. We got it done. We beat his top speed goal by a little bit. That's for sure. Dude, I missed the big bets. We were betting big the last couple episodes. We dropped back down to these teeny bets. Can trade that in, get another card. Second one down. On to number three. Let's go, boys. Look, man, you may think you're so crazy, but you're a street league in Silver Rock, just like everyone else. There's nothing special about you. Ah, the insults of the middle class. We may race in Silver Rock, but we are an entire... Let's try to get to that stupid freaking gas station, dude. Wouldn't let me. There was a race in the way. Sorry to cut off the cutscene. Just gonna come back. The streets got stuck in this city. <laughs> Well, this street scum is gonna crush you. You're still gonna lose to me here, and then your friends in the house are gonna lose the outlaw's rush. <laughs> Whatever gave you the notion that I even care about that silly race? Keep up, Tyler Morgan. Oh, so this guy, he's a, a house gang or a house crew or whatever, but he doesn't actually care about the outlaw's rush? It's interesting. All right. Here we go. Our car is now four levels under leveled, but I think we're gonna be okay. Wheelie at least two times and win the race. Sure. So that means we're gonna have to come to a complete stop. More cars, more bends, more ridges. Keep up. Unless, oh, this is, okay. We just gotta wheelie off each start. Did not have my best start this this race, that's for sure. But we got this guy. So we're gonna come in. Left. This is way more fun when you actually, you're like drag racing with real people. And it's not just a straight line, win every time, nothing to actually worry about. So we've got one out of two wheelies that we need. We need uh, one more wheelie here. Unmas. Just gotta win this round. I'm gonna let him get ahead first. I'm gonna see if we can beat him without nitrous. We don't even need our nitrous, dude. Sorry, I had to. He, I mean, he ran into me there. That was not me running into him. You guys know. Where are you even at, bro? What is? <laughs> yes. 
Dude, we've got a 10 second car. We're running a nine three quarter mile. That is so disgusting. This thing is nuts. This is the most ridiculous car that we've built in this game so far. Got our side bet. Speed card, come on. Give me something good here. 13 ECU with speed. I don't know if that's gonna do it. That's not gonna do it. Trader in. Uh oh. Looks like we're gonna have another cutscene. We're running through the sky like some bad tacos. He's not gonna be happy about it. I know how much you enjoy traffic, Tyler. So we're going across a four lane highway. All right. Go, boys and this is gonna be a best of five so we're gonna have a uh, a three-round tango this guy at least is a little bit close oh, yeah. Empress in the BMW M5 there's like no traffic on this one though that was just a straight shot I don't know dude I I've always loved drag racing in games I feel like this they could do it a little bit bigger here I feel like there should be more to evade it should be a bit more difficult. It shouldn't be just, just straight up. Literally, I don't have to touch anything here. I mean, we're gonna be going over oncoming traffic there, but they're like perpendicular traffic. But it's like, it's just a straight shot. We don't even have to try here. One more, baby. Just one more. Here we go, boys. Come on, just need one more. See ya. I mean, their guys are literally cutting off the on ramps to the the street, so we don't have anything to worry about. There it is. Straight 3L. Literally nobody here has even given us like anywhere close to, to competition. Racking up the wins. We'll see what happens though. You guys remember last episode with Nova, whatever, Supernova Girl? She was actually kind of good when we raced her at the end, so. I'm hoping for the same thing here. Come on. Please tell me I made the right choice. Whew. Level 17 breaks? It's gonna take down our nitrous power. I'm not going to. Those would have been big, but I want to keep our nitrous up. That's obviously important for drag. One more crew member down, one step closer to the outlaw's rush. How about you save me some time and give me a free pass to it? Dylan Morgan, I despise you and your little maggot friends. If I could wipe you from the map, I would. Then why don't you? Come on, Receiver. You think you're so dangerous? Come out and finish this. Oh, you want dangerous? Fine. Let's do dangerous. Meet us. Meet the death. A true race in order. All right. Sounds good to me. Also, sorry, Driftstone. I'm not actually going to take you seriously in this car, bud. Oh man, we're now 24 levels down. Uh, Basilev thinks he's got a race so dangerous you won't dare face him and his crew. Defeat the diamond block and he might finally accept your challenge. Avoid collisions for 40 seconds and win the race. I'm gonna go for it, dude. It's only 950 bucks. We're not missing out on much if we don't get this. It sounds a little sketchy though. The end of this race gets a little tight. Careful. I like it tight, baby. <laughs> anyway, here we go, guys. I'm not even really gonna pay attention to our our clean driving goal. I mean, what counts as a collision? You know what I mean? That right there counted as a collision. Can we sideswipe people? Can we run over street signs? Can we hit a bump? We obviously can't hit like a big bump. Our first, oh, see, we, we just lost our collision again, okay. So the collision, the collision thing's not happening. I can tell you guys that right now. Just gonna focus on winning this race, fellas. I'm pretty sure running into a bush counts as a collision. 
And that's just against the laws of Need for Speed. This game is all about collisions. It's a good thing we learned that little drifting trick. We gotta use more of our nitrous, man. What have we collided into recently? We're at 37 seconds right there. I haven't hit anything in a really long time. This this challenge is kind of BS. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Thing is not built for turns. Gotta keep it up. It does not like them. Here we go. This is gonna be so awkward. Dude, it just doesn't. It doesn't handle curves. There we go, that wasn't bad. The good news is is neither can uh, neither can our opponents. Nobody else has hit these very well either. So what did he mean by it gets tight? That's what I want to know. Oh, just this final little bridge? I can, I can handle it. We're good to go. Yes. Let's go, boys. I like these quick little races. These are fun. Lost the 950. That was a that was kind of a baloney challenge. I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I'm not happy with that. Level 17 head with acceleration. Gonna lose a little bit of nitrous power, a little bit of top speed. Zero to 60 and everything is gonna go up. I'm gonna take it. Level 17 is a huge level, dude. We've gotta go for that. No, no, no! Useless, all of them. Gorgeous view, Vasilev. Thanks for the tour. Silent rat. That was a badass Lambo right there. Holy cow, dude. All right. I'm going to head on to where we're going to race this, dude. Point six eight miles away, dude. I... I love this thing, but I hate it. It's a love-hate relationship. I enjoy the drags, but when we're actually like trying to, to turn and stuff, it's really, really hard to use. The voice of the streets. Godspeed. Here's a war journal update. A major victory today for the 99% as Silver Rock's golden boy, Tyler Morgan, took Supernova for all she was worth. Inching himself even closer to the rush. Turns out Natalia Nova is more shooting style than superstar. Hey. The that crashes and burns when it gets too close to the real world. Oh, and Nova? Heads up. You can stop the Emming me, girl. You blocked. Who's a nobody? Ooh, she's a savage, dude. I love the radio girl. Man, my eyes are like watering really bad right now. So it looks like we're gonna be taking on this guy in his GTR. Mitko Vasilev has finally agreed to a one-on-one -on -one race. He most certainly has a trick up his sleeve. Stay up your guard. No matter what, you're going to lose here, Tyler Morgan. You've been wrong every time, Vasilev. Wouldn't want to break the streak. <laughs> All right, boys, here we go. Looks like we might have him off the start here. Woo! Just cut him off. We got it. Let's go, baby. We kind of saved our nitrous just a little bit to start off there. I didn't use it right away, so it didn't add to our wheelie, but it helped us get in front of him kind of like in the middle of the, the drag. So that was good. That was actually really close, though. At least these are close. How about I make you look like a fool this time? I feel like my shifts actually matter here. I feel like what I'm doing matters not... I'm just beating out the competition no, no problem every time. Yes! <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna 
to get dirty if I have to. This is so much more fun. Drag racing like this where it's either really close or you have a lot of stuff to evade. The other ones where we're just blowing people out are not fun. Not fun at all. We were going to beat that guy whether or not we wrecked him there. It doesn't matter how many I just thought it'd be funny to wreck him. I feel like we have our nitrous down at a good spot. Because we catch him in the middle of the race and then we get more nitrous afterwards. Get out in front of him. Oh, that's that's it. GG. It's like in the old Fast and the Furious movies. Too early. Goodbye, Mr. Morgan. Enjoy jail. Too early. Oh, of course. One out of 13. We're pursuing that 410. So that's why I said that no matter what happened, I was gonna lose. What do you have in the subject vehicle? Looks like a McLaren 570 S. All units be advised, one out of 13 is in a code 3 pursuit. All available units, come on. Woo! Gotcha! Hit him with the hot sandwich. That asshole called the goddamn cops on me. That guy's unhinged, Ty. You got lucky, it's just cops. Tell me I'm lucky after I get out of here. I'll try to lose them near the city. You got this, Ty. See you when you're clear. I mean, we're already kind of clear, man. We got both. Oh no, more spawn behind us. I can't believe that dude. The cops, after all that big talk, at least send a private security force or something. That is kind of a bitch move. He he put up a good fight in the drag race, though. I'll give him that. Like I'm, I, I wish all the races could have been like that. Still alive, Tyler. Still alive, still pissed. Just this guy's going on my list. Okay, so if I'm not wrong, your list now has Navarro for portraying you, Vasila for portraying you, and Max for stealing your favorite wrench that one time. The cops literally can't keep up with us. They keep spawning behind us, and then they're just gone. <laughs> All right, they're gone. Dude, that was insane. We just beat the the goal time by almost 20 seconds. That was awesome. All right. Oh, we had no side of it. Or side bet for that event. Interesting. Right side, exhaust level 14 with jump. Yeah, I'll pass. Drag quest line complete, boys. Diamond block has been defeated. Ooh, we just got the Uraka. <gasps> yes, daddy. I love it. And the Mercy, Lamborghini Mercy. Yo, chick, she's so thirsty. Oh, it's got the green stitching on the inside too. We're gonna have to go with that Verde Ithaca color on the, uh, the, the Mercy. Big man. How did it all turn out? Well, we're definitely not gonna be grabbing lunch anytime soon. But the Z-Lab's done. You won't stand between us and the rush. Makes me worry, Ty. Silence from a guy like that is never good. I'll let you do the worrying for us. I'm just glad those races are over. One less thing between us and the rush. I prefer to think of it as one last thing between us and the house. <laughs> Couldn't agree more. All right, boys, good stuff. Another quest line down. We have um, off-roading. And then we've got enforcing coming up next. So I uh, hope you guys are ready. I'm going to see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.